What's up guys, how are you guys doing today? In this video, what we'll do is we'll create a variable that can reference the other actors or objects using a blueprint. And then we'll create some fire on the barrel using basic concepts of blueprint. Basically, we will learn how to reference other objects using blueprint. So to get started, what we'll do is we'll go to our create project and we'll go to the games first person make sure the blueprint is selected with the starter content is on and now we'll just give a name whatever name you want you can just go ahead with that name and we'll click on create and then it should create your first person template game and there it is it's very basic uh, all the starter contents are there if I go ahead and play Basically, I can go ahead and grab the gun and then I can shoot my bullets Which is very strange because it does look like a, you know ball and balls and To get started what we'll do is uh, we'll go ahead and right click on this uh, content browser I'll create a new folder called uh, Blueprints basically this is my blueprints and this is where we'll store the blueprint so I'll go right click, click on the blueprint class and then make sure you are selecting an actor type and then we'll give pp underscore barrel and that would be the name of the blueprint. So go ahead and double click on the pp underscore barrel and it should open pp underscore barrel which is pretty empty so we'll go ahead and add a component so to add what we'll do is we'll go to the component tab type in a static mesh and then give a name called barrel you know whatever you want for this video purpose I will just go ahead and select a cylinder which is actually comes default you know just type in a cylinder in there and you should see save cylinder okay and that would be our barrel but if you have a 3d model of a barrel maybe if you download it from sketchfab or something I'll also probably put a, put a link of a you know 3d model of a barrel in here so you can if you want to use it. so to go ahead and compile next thing what we'll do is we'll actually you uh, make a reference variable that we were talking uh, and underneath the my blueprint go to the variables and then go ahead and click on the, that plus icon and then type in the name bp underscore fire okay and then for the variable type this is where we need to make sure that we are actually referencing an object so we'll go ahead and type in object types and then if you type in fire you should see the blueprint effect fire so basically in that we are trying to get an object reference okay this object reference is null by default um, and which you can see on our detail panel and so we'll make sure this is instance editable so basically we want to edit in our editor window <laughs> which is kind of funny editor in our editor um, yeah so basically we want the uh, the designer or uh, you know developer to define it okay so we'll just uh, go ahead and grab this um, variable and make sure you select the getter and from the getter what we will do is uh, in the context menu just type in hidden and make sure you select the set hidden in games p underscore fire so basically we want this to be you know hidden by default and we want this to show up only when basically when we get an event hit so when somebody hits me then I will display this or else I'm going to be hit. That's what basically that's the logic we are trying to do. So uh, go ahead and uh, you know select that execution pin to the set hidden in games and uh, go ahead and compile this and let's go back into our scene editor and in here what you will do is basically go ahead and grab that bp underscore barrel and just drag and drop to place of your choice okay and what we'll do next is we'll go to the starter contents and go to the blueprint and this is a default blueprint that we'll use you know 
when the person shoots this barrel this is what we want to populate so you can see a beautiful fire by default thanks to Unreal Engine team for providing this fire and we don't want this fire to be running when our game is playing so what we'll do is go ahead and select the the blueprint fire and underneath the P fire in a detail panel go ahead and select hidden and what we'll do is basically in rendering we'll do hidden in game so it doesn't populate you know fire by default now we'll click the BP underscore barrel and um, under underneath that BP fire the reference variable that we had added uh, we basically want to add that BP fire that we grabbed from the blueprint. So right here in our blueprint, BP underscore fire, go ahead and select that uh, blueprint. Okay. And that's all we need to do. So basically run this and by default nothing shows up and I can shoot the gun and nothing happens. But if I shoot the barrel, then you can see a beautiful fire right there. Yeah, hopefully uh, this was a very short and quick tutorial, you know, um, hopefully you were able to understand the concept of uh, basically um, referencing an object in Blueprint. And with that, I will conclude this tutorial. If you have any comments, concerns, please type in the chat and I will check out the next time.